Well, that's good to hear. You know, you, because in a lot of a lot of what we'd heard before was people were just ready to get the heck out of the building, even though it was WWE. And you know that has to be frustrating when you're trying to do your job and you can't stand the place you work, and especially when you're in the public eye like that. It had to be so frustrating for everybody dealing with that kind of stuff. Well, yeah, there was a there was a lot of frustration, and uh, you know, it was it was interesting because you had a alternative which was AEW and for a while there it was funny when when AEW first started you know there was there was so much frustration within WWE that a lot of people wanted to get out and then you know they got out some of them and then you know Vince ended up leaving and Triple H took over and then you had people that wanted to go back and so you know it's like it's a job and the grass is sometimes always greener but the thing with wrestling is you just never know what's going to happen. Like all of those people that wanted to get out because of Vince, you know, then Vince is gone and now they want it back. But then Vince comes back. You never know what's going to happen in wrestling. So really, I mean, who am I to give advice? But you just got to do the best you can with whatever hand you're dealt. Because, you know, if you're expecting that there's going to be a change, it's going to be permanent in wrestling. It's not going to happen. 